It's one of nature's most unique plants and an acclaimed superfood. It's the dragon fruit, also known as pitaya, or strawberry pear. It's a tropical fruit prized for its health benefits. The dragon fruit looks like a soft pineapple with spikes, and can have either pink, red, or yellow skin with white or red flesh. It tastes like a blend of kiwi fruit and pear. Dragon fruit plays a role in improving overall well-being. It's a nutrient-dense fruit with unmatched health benefits, from helping lower blood pressure to strengthening bones, promoting digestion and fortifying the immune system. Dragon fruit is very easy to prepare. All you have to do is, slice the fruit lengthwise, scoop out the seed speckled flesh, and enjoy it. It can be eaten by itself, or added to salads, smoothies, and yogurt. It is best enjoyed chilled. It's a misconception that the dragon fruit is bland and only mildly sweet. That happens only with imported fruits which are harvested early and are shipped for long distances. Reaching the consumer only 4 weeks after harvest. In reality, the Indian dragon fruit tastes sweet with a crunchy texture, as the fruit is allowed to mature naturally on the plant itself at ideal temperatures between plus 10 degrees Celsius and and 36 degrees Celsius thus giving it a naturally sweet and succulent taste. As the fruit has a shelf life of 2 weeks at room temperature. It's true that the dragon fruit is a delicious tropical fruit, but the good news is, you don't have to live in the tropics to enjoy the dragon fruit. In fact, you can find it fresh in India. Organizations ICARIH Ahira Hali Farm Tumgor established experimental trials on dragon fruit in the year 2012 to assess the performance and develop cultivation practices and promotion of dragon fruits in India. Under the supervision of Dr. M. R. Dinesh, Director, IIHR Bengaluru, and Dr. Karan Akaran, Principal Scientist and Head, Hirahali Farm. Dr. Srinivas Rao would dedicate progressive dragon fruit farming in collaboration with Icar IIHR initiated cultivation after visiting 11 different dragon fruit cultivated countries across the world. Now he has established organizational setup in the name of Deccan Exotics, a progressive farm and research center spread over 30 acres in Telangana specializing in the cultivation of superior varieties of dragon fruit. Deccan Exotics has been helping to promote dragon fruit cultivation, by providing guidance and consultancy, apart from supplying superior saplings to the farmers.